It is one of the most popular series on the Hallmark Channel with millions of loyal fans who call themselves Hardies. Paul Green plays Dr. Carson Shepherd on When Calls the Heart, and he is in Nashville for a big event this weekend. We are so glad to have the Cary Grant of Hallmark <laughs> here in the studio with us. How are you? Yes, I'm really good. It's nice to be here. It's so humid outside. When I arrived, the doors were sweating on the ho on the hotel when I arrived. Welcome day. to Nashville. Yeah. <laughs> it's great to be here. I'm so glad you're here. Okay, so tell us about Carson Shepherd. Why do you love playing that role? Well, it's, you know, it's what's so cool about the show itself is, is I grew up on Little House on the Prairie. So it's Michael Landon Jr. that created our show. And, you know, I just, they're so nostalgic when you watch it. And I, and being able to play a doctor, I just love because, yeah. and I'm really into that sort of stuff anyway, like mm -hmm. nutrition and medicine and, and helping people like feel better. So it's, it, and he's just, a, it's a really great character and really well written and the cast is amazing and we're on season nine already. So it's a, it's a, it's an honor to be a part of it. And of course, Hallmark is in everybody's homes. Like, yeah. you know, 90 million homes or something. Isn't that remarkable? Yeah, yeah. yeah. And talk about a fan base. The Hardys yes. are huge. Yes, special love for the Hardys. They are incredible. They're so organized and loyal and loving and um, this year was intense though because there was a big love triangle where some didn't like the choice so like it was you saw some some fists come out a little bit yeah. like there's a there's an intentional love triangle built but it was it's a they're amazing people but well, we're all team Carson here so. oh, okay yeah. all right good, <laughs> good, 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 good and when good. we last saw Carson um, he'd proposed to Faith mm -hmm. she turned him down yeah broke a lot of Hardy's hearts right and yeah. then and then decided to leave so what's the future <sighs> Well, the future is really up in the air. I mean, I know I'm going back to do a few things, at least it's in the works to go back and, and do a little bit of filming this year for uh, On When Calls a Heart. But, you know, it's, there's, it's a tumultuous time, it's 1918, so, you know, and, and there's a lot of changing things happening in that town within all the dynamics of the relationships. And so we'll see. But as far as I know, there's gonna be, uh, a fair amount of Carson this year. Good. I know yes. your fans are going to be excited. Yes. <laughs> uh, a lot of folks may or may not know um, that you do music as well, and you're performing this weekend. I am. Yeah, I grew up in a very musical church family. I was a drummer in our church, and then I, when my, at 18, somebody bought me a Bible and a guitar, and that really changed my life. It really went traveling the whole world with my guitar and started writing songs in my 20s, and then just recently had an opportunity to play at Carnegie Hall for, uh, for a fundraiser for Kate Winslet's Autism Foundation. Oh, wow. And after I got off the stage at Carnegie Hall, I was like, I'm so, I was so lit up that I wrote uh, Freedom for Your Soul, which is yeah. my latest album that's out now. And then there was the fine folks here at Rama Drama invited me to Nashville to perform uh, tomorrow night, Saturday the 31st, here uh, yeah. at the Jameson. Mm -hmm. And I'd be doing mostly my originals and a few covers for, nice. on the show. Oh, that'll be great. You also have big family news coming up uh, I, around Thanksgiving, right? Yes, yeah, similar to yours. Yeah. Congratulations on, on you. being a grandma. Thank you. Again, five times? Yeah, yeah. Nice. Yes, this is my second time being a dad. And our little ones do Thanksgiving Day, which is really cool. Oh, how wonderful. And your son is 18 years old, so you haven't done this baby thing in a while. It's true. I hope I still got it. I was really good at doing diapers. <laughs> and I, I actually, that little, that phase was so amazing. And I, actually all the phases, I, nothing I enjoyed more than being a father to my nice. son, Oliver. So I, I can imagine the second time even being better because it's the second time. You have a little bit more like, oh, that's just fine. That, they're fine. Yeah, you're not so scared. <laughs> right. right, right. Oh, that's wonderful. Yeah. Well, I know folks are going to be so excited to get to meet you this weekend at Rama Drama and, and to hear you perform as well. That's right. There's there's uh, step and repeats where people come and there's there's things that I sign autographs and do selfies and there's bags and hats and posters and all, all kinds of it. CDs and all kinds of goodies. Got to be a fans. big weekend. Paul's yeah. show is tomorrow night at the factory at Franklin Jameson Hall. Doors open at 7 30 p.m. It is part of Rama Drama going on all weekend long. Get tickets and more information online at ramadrama.com. Thanks so much. Yeah, thanks, sir. Thanks for having me.